Hi, back at it again for another log. Writer's log. Writer report. Whatever. I really didn't do much because I was just lying in my bed be feeling sorry for myself. What's new? Alright, so for the most part of this week, I just prepared for the writing workshop, which was easier than I expected. I read some, you know, my old notes from Arcadia. And I read stuff from this book right here. Hi! And it was very helpful. There are, were a lot of concepts that were, I guess, too advanced for the beginner's workshop that I intended to um, do. So I didn't use all of the information, but it's a good read and it helped me realize some things about my own story, which made me sad and disappointed in myself. But you know what's different, what's new, it's my brand. Why did I say that? What brand? Uh, the other thing that I did was fix my query letter as well as create some Twitter blurbs for the pitch event next week. Oh my god, it's next week. After that, I showed it to some people to get some feedback on them and I got a lot. Uh, <laughs> honestly, very helpful. It's just that I can't take criticism at all because I feel like it's a personal attack because I'm a Leo rising and everything has to be about me. Uh, it's helpful to get feedback from other people because not everything I do is perfect and I should always look for improvement and just because you, there's something that I can improve on doesn't mean it's inherently bad in its original form. I just need a little bit of help and don't be all, really. <laughs> The workshop was great, I'll talk more about that later, but for the most part of this week I've been in such a slump. I have been struggling with how I feel about my story, about the manuscript, and how it looks like right now. I'm struggling also with how I haven't edited anything of it just yet, and I'm planning to submit it to agents, professional agents, and... <laughs> It's done, but it's not good, and I'm struggling with that. And the fact that I have to make it somewhat presentable by next week gives me a lot of feelings that I don't want to have right now. But what can you do? You know, mental health doesn't wait for anybody, and neither does time, and neither does capitalism, so I have to suck it up by tomorrow which, I mean, tomorrow I'm going to be out of the house doing errands for myself. And then it's going to be a fun time. I have to do some work on the story. It doesn't have to be all of the work because I'm sure that, you know, in my head I'm going to be like, ah, oh, you didn't do this, you didn't do that. But it's better than doing nothing. I've been really mean to myself for the last week, so I have to work on that again. I have to keep working on that, which is sad because I should be done, but... Uh. One very good thing about this week was the workshop yesterday, which was great. A couple of people canceled at the last minute, which is a total bummer. But the people who were there and the person that showed up randomly from Davao Christian High School, hi Casey, they were great. They were very receptive and they were very um, interactive during the whole thing. And, you know, I think I did something that wasn't complete bullshit. Who would have thought? So I'm very happy and proud of myself for that. Um, I imparted knowledge and that felt really good. I was just having a pretty shit day that day. So I didn't feel the full spectrum of joy that I should be feeling. Objectively, I am telling myself, you did fine. One of the people at the workshop is a DM who does stuff for, you know, newbies in the Dungeons and Dragons thing. So I'm gonna join her next week, even though I'm not a technically like a newbie, newbie. But next week I'm gonna join her with a couple of people and we'll play a game because I want to do that and I haven't had a chance to do that here in Davao. So that's pretty much it. Stick around, subscribe. Something might happen. Maybe next week it will be less depressing.
fuck, that's a lie, because next week it's going to be the pitch event, and it's not going to be good for my self-esteem at all. So, I'm pretty upbeat right now. I don't know. <laughs> so, let's see how it goes next week.